<laughs> My name's Elise and I'm a volunteer at Include Me Too Club. Studying at home has been quite difficult because there's no social interaction with anyone, it can be really isolated. Um, it's really hard not to see anyone you know and just being sitting at the same desk every day. Um, during lockdown the Community Meals project was really positive uh, to get out of the house and to help other people. It can really lift your mental health um, and obviously getting to work as part of a good team uh, was really good as well. I think it's one of the things that had the biggest impact on the community, not only our members. I think a lot of older people in the community and also families benefited so much from it. Um, you could just see it like when you went over and gave them the meals just how grateful they were to even just speak to someone or to just like see a friendly face every day. It definitely changed the outlook especially in lockdown instead of just you know sitting in feeling sorry for yourself or like I wish I could go out uh, you're actually just actively doing things to make other people better because even though I was not obviously having fun during lockdown I knew that there was many people that were in such a worse situation than me. I think it really brightened what was a really hard time for everyone. Um, it was great to get out there and meet other young people that were community minded like myself uh, and just form a really good team. Uh, and it really brightened lockdown, I think for all of us I could say. So this year the Young Volunteer Group at Include Me Too Club have became finalists for the Young Scott Awards. Uh, it's such an honour to be recognised nationally among so many other amazing young people. Uh, obviously it's not why we do stuff like this but it's just uh, a real positive uh, to kind of round up hopefully what is the end of lockdown. <laughs> uh, obviously after lockdown I'm going to continue to volunteer at Include Me Too Club um, with different things like the social clubs and stuff. So. I'm looking forward to getting all the social clubs back on at Include Me Too Club and seeing all the members together again uh, and also like personally just getting out with my friends and just having fun. I can't honestly say there's anything I'll miss about lockdown at all.